Kota Khan, Danzaru, the water. In Niji, position. Okay, basically, we see it from a, from a linear, we see it from a cross graph, different ways to neutralize it. Now we're going to go nuclear. This is my favorite part of the art because we actually take a copper horn and we go nuclear with it. Okay, A, and grab, any type of grab, any kind of this type of situation, basically the person has attacked me, and so it's easy to neutralize it. It's much more difficult if he comes at me with punches because I'm not going to be able to neutralize that. Okay, the first thing I want to do is I want to keep my live hand free. So as he goes to one, one hand is going to actually pick up both hands. I'm going to give him, I'm going to neutralize his, his lead, and then I'm going to force him to play with both hands, his reverse. So when I move, I slap it, he's already in position. Okay, so am I. Once I move, my hand is already in position. Now, he's recycled, he's going to turn into me, and he's going to let me have it. So I need to neutralize that third threat. And the way I do that is force him to take a hit. I force him to take my feet. So as I move, I come across. Now, let's just say he doesn't block it, and he goes to punch. It doesn't matter. He's neutralized. I've neutralized my opponent. Game is over. Checkmate. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to neutralize it with a strike. I'm going to force him to play the game. If he punches, I knock him out. If he picks it up, I got Moniji. Either way you look at it, game's over. Okay. So in slow motion, when we move, I'm going to go one, create a gap, and come across. Once I'm moving in this position, I'm going to manipulate my opponent into Momiji. This is how simple it is. One, two, three, pull up this, and this is Momiji. This is the best way to practice it, because now we're dealing with the question. We're actually making our art combative. Okay? So, what three? Right. Oh, three. Two more. 